Hey everybody, this is Liz with the Friends of the Gallup National Forest Avalanche Center. I am one of the Avalanche Awareness Instructors, one of 40 in fact. And I'm here today to talk to you about how to accurately uh, identify appropriate slope angles. So avalanche terrain is defined as terrain that is 30 degrees or steeper. So if you are uh, in terrain that is less than 30 degrees, you are generally safe from avalanches unless you are on a slope that's attached to something a little bit steeper. There are two great ways to determine what slope angle you are in. Number one, technology. There's great apps out there that'll tell you slope angle with shading and all that fun stuff. However, when you are actually in the avalanche terrain, you want to ground truth that with a slope angle reader, tool number two. So let's see where we're at on this slope I'm standing on here. I'm gonna take my slope angle reader and I'm going to place it in the snow as level as I can and see where we're at. This is reading out at 25 degrees. So in general, on this slope, I am safe from avalanches. Another way that you can use your slope angle reader to determine the steepness of a slope is by simply holding it up to a slope in the distance to see what the steepness is. When I'm traveling in the mountains and I'm getting close to avalanche terrain and it has a, an elevated avalanche danger where I'm starting to get worried about something coming from above and potentially hitting me down, down on the flats in the runout zone, um, I use my inclinometer. I usually carry it in my pocket. I can whip it out really fast and I can tell by measuring the slope angle if in fact I'm in the runout zone. How you do that is you hold your inclinometer up, you sight along the top edge to where you think the avalanche is gonna break from, where the crown would be. And if that angle is less than 20 degrees, you're not in the runout zone. If you're too close, that angle's gonna be larger. It'll be more than 20. And that means that if it went big, it could definitely catch you. So the closer we get to the, the slope, the, the larger the angle becomes, and that means it gets more dangerous. So 20 degrees, is the number we want when we're using this. So remember, if the slope you're standing on is greater than 30 degrees, you are in avalanche terrain. If the slope angle between you and a start zone is greater than 20 degrees, you're in the runout. When conditions are dangerous, build yourself in a little bit extra margin for error.